Hi, I'm Chris. And I'm Cynthia. And we're the Haney family. And for those of you that are new here, welcome and let's enjoy some great music together. All right, so what do we have for the Goonies today? Well, today's Friday, so we're going to do our Friday favorites for you guys. And it just so happens I found one on my list on our list our list yes and by cindy lawfer who happens to be a very favorite of mine our list yes our list (laughs) anyway the song suits the season because it's called feels like christmas feels like christmas and i've never heard a christmas song by cindy lawfer before but it only feels like christmas yeah, well, we're not there yet, so it kind of does. It's kind of oh, like that. Oh, yeah, like early yeah. before Christmas. Then it feels like, yeah, well, because the store's in November, and yeah. they keep just pushing this stuff out all year. Yeah. All season, I should say. But this is from... Right through fall into the summer. Yes, right oh. after right after Halloween. Right after Halloween. Yeah. They don't even wait for Remembrance Day. But we do. We I, do. We didn't decorate till December. That's true. Yes. Yeah. But anyways, this one was suggested by Planet Char, and I love Cindy Lauper. She is definitely a favorite since I was a little girl, 10 years old. Yeah. So definitely excited about doing a song I don't know of hers. Mm -hmm. And this time we found a live performance because every other one I found, I put it on for a couple seconds to check the sound quality and it wasn't right. Yeah, it's in one speaker. Yeah. um just terrible it sounded almost like maybe a demo it was Mm. kind of odd so i thought yeah i'm gonna do this live performance that i found because it sounded really good from the few seconds i heard maybe she never used it in an album maybe not i don't know but Mm. you guys will let us know i'm sure (laughs) yeah so uh i guess we should check this out then yes this is cindy lopper live with feels like christmas so awesome yeah oh my gosh i wonder when this performance was because it looks like she's already quite a bit older there i think that's possible for sure it it looks fairly recent if i'm 
honest. Like, yeah. I remember the last time I saw Cindy on TV, like fairly recently, that's the way her hair was. Yeah. Like, yeah. So I think I think this is a fairly recent thing. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Uh, the video that we were talking about is um, what was it about? That was uh, it was about um, USA for Africa. Oh right. Yeah, yes. Uh, we are the world. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, there was a great thing they have it on Netflix. It's really fun. Uh, you really get to see the humanity of these artists. Oh yeah, because you, you know, get to see all the background of how they put it all together and what they did. They actually did the whole recording the night of the AMAs. Yeah, which so is crazy. they did the American Music Awards. Lionel Richie hosted the American Music Awards that year. That year, yeah, yeah, and. Uh, you know, he did the whole show, and then he helped usher all the big stars out of the front row into the USA for Africa recording. Yeah, and they spent the whole night. Whole night. I saw it well, yeah. when I stopped watching <laughs> We didn't finish watching it because it was late, and we didn't Yeah. Um, actually, we had to do our videos. Yeah. So we stopped. Uh, but, um, yeah, it was like when we last looked, it was like 5 in the morning, and they were still there, you know, some of them are pretty punchy at that point because yeah. you know they're sitting around. Some of them are waiting to get their parts done, and and some of them are trying. They start, and of course, they started with this big U, where each one of them had to sing in front of each other. Yeah, so, and that's terrifying because some of them were huge fans of each other too. Yeah, yeah. Some crazy <laughs> but this stuff. is um this is very good. It's different for Cindy. I've never seen her actually play an instrument, to be honest. Yeah. I didn't know. I knew she knew a lot about music and how sure. to put it together, but I didn't know that she was a multi-instrumentalist. That's which, true. Yeah, we figured maybe piano or guitar, is. but she's got a dulcimer there, and recorder. She yeah, exactly. So this is fantastic, and her vocal is still so strong and beautiful. That's true. And I want to know what that microphone is. Oh. <laughs> I've never seen it before. Well, I'm sure maybe there's somebody that would know what wanted it know what mic that is yeah i'm gonna yeah. have to look for it <laughs> i'm curious i i, I know it, it's great for her voice so I'm, I'm wondering if these are the people she normally has with her all the time maybe that are playing with her i don't know for certain because mm. i really only paid attention to be honest to her and not who is yeah. around her so y much you do that yeah but yeah, this is really interesting. Great yeah. sound. I, I I love anything that starts with a dulcimer. It's really awesome. It's a different feel. It almost gives you a bluegrassy feel. That's true. But that's because of the dulcimer and the mandolin and things like that. Yeah, more of a folky feel. Yeah, more folky than yeah. blue uh, bluegrass. Yeah. 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 But she's got that edge to her, and that's what I love. That's true. <laughs> so let's keep it going. All right. She is such a good person. Like she is. you can see it. It's so great. Absolutely. She's such amazing. a wonderful person and yeah. talent. Uh, oh. Heck of a performer. Yes. Absolutely. She is amazing. She sings the best kind of stuff. Uh just sounds great all the time. And yeah. she's consistently great too. 
Yeah, she's never, I've never heard her have a bad performance. Mm -hmm. Like everything I've ever heard her do, I loved it. It's, she's just, it's so natural to her to just sing, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, for sure. And, you know, clearly she, you know, she's a multi-instrumentalist. I don't know how much she plays on her actual, you know, albums I'm and not stuff. sure, but... I'm sorry, I have to say, I saw a thumbnail for a second with her wearing what looks like a washboard. Uh, I see that. That's kind of funny. That's funny. Anyway. <laughs> She's crazy. Yeah, I love everything about her. She's so different and quirky and wonderful and talented, you know. Mm -hmm. Just fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> and she surrounds herself with great musicians as well. That's true. You can tell. everybody there was playing very well. Mm -hmm. you know yeah well those are the best kind of people i mean her uh uh well billy joel and also from the, the usa for africa they was yeah. as soon as they saw each other they hugged because they're the only people who really knew each other yeah it was yeah. kind of interesting the nerves that they had as stars was really funny to see that's true you know running over and getting each other's autographs and things like that yeah. was the weirdest thing and they spent like almost an hour just kind of signing each other's autographs it's Crazy. so funny but i guess you know they're just people like you said before and you know they're fans of those stars too yeah it's kind Crazy of an is. interesting thing but yeah cindy is amazing in this and yes this was really great yeah um, hey great christmas song it really is and it's not exactly kind of, just yeah. a christmas song. exactly it it's feels more like of a christmas. love song yeah, it's a love song that says because she says it feels like christmas every day with you yeah that's what she said nothing wrong with that yeah so this was very good. So thank you very much for that suggestion. I definitely loved that one. And I know Chris enjoyed it as well. Yes, another almost Christmas song. Yes. <laughs> really good one. Really great request. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Don't forget to check us out over on Patreon. It's $3 a month and we're adding things there all the time. You'll find the link in the description of all our videos. You'll also find our blocked videos there for free. If you want to come and check those out, you're more than welcome to do that. And if you pay the $3, you get access to our albums, documentaries, and little concerts over there. It's a whole lot of fun. Lots of fun. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and become one of our Goonies. Share with your family and friends. Click the notification bell if you don't want to miss a video. And don't forget to enjoy yourself. Later. Later.